mother is at the bridge table with Loretta, Gert, and Pearl when my father finds his way to heaven. Sit down, dear, she says, patting the seat beside her and barely looking up from the hand she's been dealt. The game is almost through. But my father is too overcome to sit. He stands and stares at his beloved, free of wheelchair and oxygen tank, happily puffing away on a Chesterfield King held between two perfectly manicured fingers, sipping a cup of instant Maxwell House, leaving a bright red lip print on the white china cup. Her hair, the lovely chestnut brown it was the day they met, her face free of worry lines, the diamond pendant he bought her on their first trip to Europe glittering against her ivory throat. She looks like the star of an old black and white movie who would never give him the time of day, but somehow spent 63 years by his side. I missed you, my father tells my mother, leaning down to kiss her offered cheek. Of course you did, said my mother, who always knows everything. She plays her cards right, and after Loretta and Pearl and Gert fold, she stands to let my father take her in his arms and in their heavenly bodies they dance. <laughs>